whoa. So this is our first day here. We literally just stepped out of the hotel. And it's funny how like, it's a very like combination of crust and really nice modern stuff. It's like marble and crust. <laughs> that's, like the best, that's like the best way I can like explain this place. But there's a skate spot across the street that I want to check out. So I think that's like the first thing we're about to go do. Oh, I well, think I think blood. there's like, oh, there's spaces in between them. That's mm. what I'm seeing. So, we're gonna check this flat bar spot out. Whoa, it starts at the bottom too. Like, look how like it starts down there. Like, that's so weird. You like ride on and grind yeah, up it. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, this is insane. Like, between this, like, what the heck? You can literally like ride and grind up these. There's a bunch of these like, lights that are like kickers essentially tons of, okay this is what i found that's like amazing I, it's kind of hard to skate but look you can kind of go through this and grind over the gap it's like so crazy you can probably actually grind it the other way might be easier to actually go from there grind pop and land here but oh my god this is crazy <laughs> yo seriously like what the actual the ground is kind of like gnarly but like what what that what this is so crazy like this is so crazy so this is the spot that we found on shinner app actually it's like really fresh like i saw this little curve part huh skate shop. there's a skate shop oh there is a skate shop over there what the heck yo look at this What the heck? This is insane. And there's a freaking skate shop right there. That's so crazy. Whoa, this is insane. I wonder what the kick out is like here. First drink? I'm getting very mixed messages here. It's like, is it skate friendly or is it not skate friendly? But like that's super buttery. Like, these things are really cool. There's like wall rides everywhere. Whoa. Found a skate shop. They have a really nice ledge out front. It's not skated though. <laughs> I was surprised. So that was so funny. Um, I just had my first experience with um, the cops here, or security here, and it was hilarious. He was like, don't, don't pop on the lights because you can break them. Otherwise, then yeah, I can still skate. Yeah. <laughs> He was he was cool with me like just skating around though. He's like, yeah, you can cruise, just don't pop on the lights. That was so funny. She's on a cat hunt. Oh, what's up, guys? Oh, there's no one over there. Oh, they're getting fed too. Okay, so we walked around for a little bit. It does seem like the area does have a few security guards. I don't know, we're kind of like in a weird area right now, so I'm gonna try to skate this, but this thing is so sticky. I just tried to like put my board in a feeble position and it's like, it's like, it's pretty gnarly. So I think it's only gonna, I don't know if it's gonna even 50-50. I know it'll board slide, so you'll have to pop out, but I don't know, we'll kind of see what we can do with this thing. Bring a towel next time. I know. It's just very do it. I'm gonna come back, I'm gonna get whack. Grass is wet, so like my feet are slipping a little bit. Like I literally have to keep coming back and like doing this to dry off my shoes, but it's really sticky for what it is. Like there's so many little like nooks and crannies over here. Whoa, so we got to actually come inside the capsule shop right now. It's like closed right now, but they make the reinforced skateboards. These ones are like all carbon fiber. Like look at these things. Oh, like look how crazy these are. Like even Braille tested a bunch of these. They had like some crazy bend and whatnot. But yeah, whoa, such a nice shop though. And this is my man T right here taking me around. I'm just catching up on so much stuff. I've had so many questions. And so we're finally getting filled in about the cats. 
Well, the cats were brought from Egypt okay. to eat the snakes because Cyprus was full of, full of snakes. <laughs> so that's a deal with the stray cats and okay. Cyprus being so full of cats. Okay, wow. Because it does make sense because I was like, there are, I'm like, they have to be rodent control or something because it's like <laughs> insane. So many like skate spots here. Yes. That's Cyprus. That's full Cyprus. Of ledges, full of everything. And like you were saying, it's kind of crazy how like skateboarding, like skateboarding is not illegal. Like it, you, I don't know how to explain that. Yeah, it's not actually illegal. Like nowhere. Like it's chill. Like it's it's a, it's a skate free zone. Yeah, nobody cares. And it's kind of crazy. I feel like how not enough people come here to skate. I feel like for how skate friendly it is and how much stuff there is here. Yeah. Uh, I mean, yeah, it's far away, but I'm surprised that a lot of these like teams, especially like on like their Euro, like their Euro trips, like they don't make the stop here. And Is it just like just, unknown or? Yes, yeah, somehow, yeah, because like nobody big came here to say. Cyprus is a good spot or anything. I see. No one's and exposed at like uh, like Barcelona or something. Yeah. Like. Oh, this is it. This is bloody. Ideas. So is this just like at a normal like playground park? Yeah. Yeah, kind of. That's. Uh, and you can just park right. Wow, this is crazy. Oh my goodness. Oh wow, this is crazy. Because I've seen this spot. I've seen that ledge in a few videos. Yeah. Oh wow, there's like a lot to kind of mess around here, dude. Whoa. Yeah, there is. And it's, so wait, what is this? It's just like an old built, like you can just skate here though? Like yeah, obviously. Yeah, you can just skate here, it's no problem. That's so cool, wow. Skaters used to skate here for like 20 to 30 years old. Wait, like, this spot's yeah. that old? Yeah, maybe even more, I'm not sure. Wow, oh, so I feel like, see this was definitely worth coming here than the skate park. Yeah, yeah. Oh, this was definitely worth it. We're gonna hit the skate park, but this is like some historic stuff right here. Whoa, I am stoked. That it hasn't been skating as much because of the cracks and stuff and like is there a new spot or something people have been Not skating or the cracks and these type of things but like people just stop skating mostly in cyprus that's crazy that the skate scene it's almost it's like it seems like it's dying but growing yeah right now it's growing back that's awesome. Good. That's good to see though. Wow, this place is so crazy. But yeah, I've seen that. Yeah, this is like the ledge that I've seen, like people skate. It's actually a lot longer than I thought. But it's also really sick. Whoa, dude, there's a lot here to do. And this capsule is holding it down right now, like hooking up the spots, hopefully meet up with some more homies this week. I can't wait to try out one of their boards too, actually. Yeah, you it's did over there. One. Oh, oh, I'm gonna Whoa. So this is like a newer version of it. So it's still like the carbon fiber. It's still a lot lighter. It's way lighter than the other board. It's still like just as thick, but like, I definitely want to try this thing out while I'm here. You know, let's put some flat ground with it, you know? I don't think I've even done a kickflip yet since I've been here. <laughs> I mean, dude, it feels pretty good for like it not being a wooden skateboard. Feels pretty decent. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, Go. that was so slick. <laughs> I bet you it slides so good, huh? <laughs> oh yeah, you don't even need wax with that. You're chilling. I never used wax on mine. Yeah, you don't need well, it. That's good. <laughs> it's that's crazy. good. Yeah. It's a yeah. It doesn't feel that much heavier. Yeah, it's just like hundred grams or something. It's nothing. It's nothing. I like this better. Yeah. How long have you been skating this? About three months, four. Nice. Look yeah, at that. I know. Three, wow. four months. Dude, because it feels really good still. Yeah, I know. That's what's insane. That's a lot of capsule. Dude, Never ending. I, I'm actually like, I'm actually blown away yeah. <laughs> on how good it actually skates. It's not bad. Definitely warmed up. 
Make, oh yeah, do you guys have wax at the shop? Yeah. I'm gonna buy wax. I forgot. I should have remembered when we were in the skate shop. Yeah, and I forgot too. Because literally my friend was like, oh, bro, but did you bring wax? And I was like, nope. Like, I didn't even think about that. Thought. So nice. Damn, the little truck behind looks so cool. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, yeah, it, it feels as good as it looks. You know? <laughs> oh, yeah, it feels that good. I just needed a nice marble edge. That's all <laughs> this is I just needed. a simple marble edge. It's not that big of a mess. Oh. So I'm not even joking. When I say like I traveled 7,000 miles or whatever, I saw this ledge and it is one thing I really wanted to skate. So I'm really happy that we got to skate it or at least come here and see it. <laughs> Where was the flip? I had to warm up. <laughs> <laughs> it like bounced. Uh, we have to dip really soon, but I do want to do like one more. I mean, that was okay. No pressure. No pressure though. First trick, not really. First tea, first tea. First tea, baby. <laughs> All right, so we're back at the hotel right now. Just took a quick shower. A lot of fun just getting a little session with Tia. But it was kind of funny when Tia mentioned to me how like the skate scene isn't that big here until the Olympics happened. It was almost as if the Olympics kind of put skateboarding on the map here. It's cool and it's kind of lame in the sense that it had to take the Olympics for them to like get down with skating. Yo, there's so many skate spots here that like everybody honestly needs to come skate here more. It's kind of crazy. To wrap up the skate session a little early today, we're going to go over to Mick's studio where she's going to be filming for the next few days. So we have to bring like a bunch of luggage. There's like cookies electrical supplies for like projectors other weird things so we're gonna go drop that off in about like 15 20 minutes so we're gonna do that and then we're do some other things but um we have to make icing. oh that's right and she has to make icing there too so we'll probably be there for a while we'll get dinner and then maybe get to skate again later <laughs> 